What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another video. As you can probably tell, this is going to be an interesting one because we are currently stuck in a boot loop. I'm kind of glad this happened because I'm going to show you guys how to get out of this boot loop. Now, what caused this is I've been toying around with some of the non-jailbreak iOS 12 tweaks like the uh, color changer for the badge badges on your icons, also the uh, carrier logo changer for iOS 12 um, and the carrier logo changer is actually what caused this boot loop that I'm stuck in right now um, and like I said I'm glad it happened on video because it might happen to some of you guys and I'm gonna show you guys how to get out of this boot loop uh, which is really annoying as you can see my device my iPhone 10s Max is basically just trying to reboot and it can't it's stuck in this boot loop um, and I don't want to lose what firmware I'm on. I don't want to be updated, none of that. So like I said, I'm going to show you guys how to get out of this boot loop. So first step is to know exactly how to do a hard reboot on your current device. Now, they're different for different devices, like the iPhone uh, 7 and 7 Plus is the power button and volume down button. You hold those simultaneously together, and that will cause... A hard reboot uh, any device older than iPhone 7 is going to be the the side button and the home button you hold those two together and then iPhone 10 and up like my 10s max or iPhone 8 and up sorry is volume up volume down and then hold the side button uh, so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna wait for the Apple logo to show up to do it so we'll just wait here a second volume up volume down hold the side button and you guys will see the screen the screen should flash. Just give it a second here. <clears throat> and there we go. It did actually um, power it down. I just wanted to make sure it worked before I said anything in video. So um, you'll know that it worked because your device will stop trying to boot up. As you guys can see, we've been at the black screen here for a few seconds now. Um, it didn't actually flash this time. The first time I attempted this, it actually kind of did a little flash on my screen and it kind of signified that it shut down. But this one, it just kind of shut down on me. Uh, and now you can see it's just a black screen. My device is no longer automatically trying to boot up, stuck in that boot loop. So from this point, all we got to do is click the side button uh, or the power button, depending on what uh, device you have, and it will boot back up. So we'll just give it a second here. I'll show you guys that it does indeed work. Um, like I said, I'm just glad this happened to me so I can show you guys how to get out of it so you don't lose your firmware. This device is currently on iOS 12.0, and uh, I'm waiting for the iOS 12 jailbreak. And uh, a boot loop could be a huge problem for some of you, some of you guys if you you know you can't figure out how to get out of it. You plug it into iTunes, you do a restore, you get stuck on iOS 12.1.3, and then you can no longer get a jailbreak or something like that. Super annoying. So I hope this video was helpful for some of you. Uh, that might have gotten stuck in this boot loop and can't figure out what to do. As you can see, the Apple logo is staying solid here. It is actually booting up, and there we go. We are out of the boot loop. That's how you're going to get out of it, guys. Um, it's pretty much all you got to do. I'll leave down in the description um, the different ways of booting up different devices. Like I said, they're different depending on what you have. Um, I mentioned them all in video, but I'll have the written form of how to boot them up or do a hard reboot on them all down in the description in case you guys missed it in video. But anyways, I hope you guys found this video useful. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That really helps me out a lot here at the channel. And if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Later.